Hi guys, and welcome to another brand new episode of the Poseidon God of War 20 show. The chill out still continues, but goes halfway through with episode 32 of 64. And welcome to Halfway House. <laughs> Oh my, what an episode I've got planned for you. Now, guys. So, we are going to get right on with that. Yes, indeed we are. So, <clears throat> how about, for starters, we, or if we take this animation break, I will see you after this. I love my four kids very much. I hope they're all okay. Mummy, you've got to come up. Lizzie, what on earth is the matter? Why are you so sad? Mum, I just... No daughter of mine is deserving of this down in the dumps feeling. Lizzie, come here. Poor Lizzie, if only we knew what's upsetting you. Come on Lizzie, tell us what's upsetting you. Oh no, Lizzie's upset again. If only we knew why. Please tell us what's upsetting you so we can work on cheering you up. I, I, I. Lizzie, please tell us what's upsetting you. It's this boy at School. Which boy at school? Randolph Parker. He thought it would be appropriate to shout sexual harassment at me. What's he been saying to you? He called me a slut and then he told me to go and hang out on a street corner because that's where whores usually tend to hang out. Why that slimy little prick? How dare he suggest that you're a whore? I will not have my daughter being treated like that. That naughty boy has not seen the last of me. I can't believe that asshole. I'd better go and give him a piece of my mind. Lizzie, your brother and sisters told us you were feeling really hurt because you were sexually harassed. So, we thought we should come and see if we can cheer our poor granddaughter up. Gran, granddad. I appreciate this, but it's going to take a considerable amount more than this to cheer me up. We understand that, sweetie. James. I think Lizzie wants to be left alone. Then, we shall leave her alone. Poor little Lizzie. I hate to see her so upset. Why would anyone want to hurt her so? Oh dear. Oh dear, our darling niece is feeling so hurt. How terrible this must be for her. Come here, baby. You need plenty of comforting. And we shall comfort you. Oh my goodness. I have to see it to believe it. Jess, have you? I have just received a mouthful of lip and sexually harassing insults about you from that horrible boy. It just sickens me how he could treat you this way. How dare he? Jess, I appreciate you being angry for me. Lizzie, I feel really hurt for you. I love you very much. You and I have always had a very close bond as cousins. You two are so close. Anyone would think you were sisters. I know what might put a smile on your face. Would you like to hold Jane? I'd love to. Here you go. Jane, you are so cute and cuddly. Bingo. That's cheered you up. How can I still be sad when I'm having cuddles with this cute little baby? Glad to be of service, my love. How are things going? Need I ask? Lizzie's happy again now. Why didn't I think of this? What? Having a baby. No, you silly sausage. Asking just to bring little Jane round to have cuddles with you. Shelby, you're a sweetheart. I think I'll have a baby of my own one day. You'd make a great mother, Lizzie. I just know it. I need to change Jane. Can I have a go at changing her? Of course. All right, Jane. Let's get you changed, good girl. Just your clean nappy to go. 
There. All done. Let's get you back to mommy. Here she is. All nice and clean. Thank you for changing her nappy. No worries, and thank you for bringing her round. Anytime, Pickle. Love you. I love you too. Both of you. All sorted. Thanks, Mum. Lizzie, you're my daughter. I love you so much it hurts me to see you so upset. I had long cuddles with little Jane. And that cheered me up. I know. Jess has just told me all about it on the phone. And it's good to have my daughter back to her usual bright cheery self. Lizzie. Yes, Olivia. Welcome back. We missed you. I didn't go anywhere. I mean we missed your cheerful smile and jokey antics. Olivia, come here. You are such a sweetheart. Thank you for the compliment. I love you. I love you too, my little honey kitten. Our Olivia is a sweet little angel. Okay guys, that was episode 15 of the Taylor Two Families. Well, the original one of it anyway. And it was her feelings and more cheering up. This time it was Lizzie with the hurt feelings and she's the one that needed the cheering up. Hmm, kind of like a, a sequel to Cheer Up Lizzie B, which was the third episode, 12 episodes before that. Anyway, now Captain Obvious is here and let's see if he minds his language this time because he's still not post watershed here he comes ahoy there I am here again aren't I well what's this I'm appearing in two episodes in one night That's never happened to me before. Well then I am new here. I know. I know you guys want to say it. So go ahead. Spill your guts. Say it. Whew. Wow. But you never thought I'd invite you to do that, eh? Pardon me. I guess I'll better be going now, guys. And I will see you next time I'm here. Thank you, Captain Obvious. And yes, indeed, as he just said, he will be back next time. And he will see you guys next time he's here. Anyway, guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What is it time for? I have no idea. So, in that light of things, it's best to stay clear. Clear of what? Clear of anything and everything that could stop you. That's right. How about we close off this episode now, guys? But not before you've seen this. Live from wherever you are right now, it's the news! Hi, James Barrett, and welcome to Nightly Newscast. Now, today, apparently, what happened today is uh, some rather odd looking men and women. Well, were crowding around Haven Park for some reason. 
I had no idea what they were doing, but I couldn't go over there because it had been boarded off. Or barriered by a fence. Strange. Um, so that's all I know. Uh, this has been your nightly newscast. I'm James Barrett, and until tomorrow, good night. And that will be this episode, guys. We are now halfway through series 25. That's right. We're there again, halfway through another series. Well, for now, the chill out is 32 episodes down, with 32 to go. And we'll be back next time with episode 33 of the chill out until then have a good night or have a good however long it takes <laughs>